Welcome to Zed, the simple and affordable compliant ELD solution. Today's video will talk about the driver signup process as well as basic app functionality. In order to sign up for Zed, first click on the App Store icon. In the search menu, search Zed Connect Inc. to pull up the Zed application. Click download to begin downloading the Zed Connect app. Once finished, click the open button. The Zed Connect app will ask you for your permission to do two of the following things. One, to send you notifications, and two, to access your location, which are both required in order to use the Zed app location and be compliant. In order to sign up, please click the appropriate position title. Please accept the terms of service. Enter the basic driver information, the CDL number, the state of issue, the first and the last name. Please take note that the CDL number must match exactly including spaces as well as any hyphens or dashes that may be required. Fill out the appropriate driver information. A valid email address and unique username are required as well as a password that requires an uppercase letter as well as a number. When the correct information is complete, click the submit button. An email will be sent to the address you provided with a verification code. Enter the verification code and click verify. Once the verification code is verified, the Z app is ready to use. You can start by selecting your appropriate duty cycle and connecting to your adapter. Log in to the Z Connect app and select the appropriate fleet. Then choose the appropriate duty status. The correct duty status for this example is on duty, not driving. To pair to the adapter, click the gray bar at the top of the screen. The screen will then show instructions on how to pair the adapter. Select the adapter from the list below. Press the blue button to put the adapter into pairing mode. After pressing the blue button, the app will prompt you and let you know that the adapter is now paired with the application and your device. Now we will take a look at some basic application usage and features. By clicking the down arrow at the top of the screen by On Duty, you can change your duty status. By selecting the duty status you select, it will bring you back to the home screen. By clicking on the Day Logs tab will let you view the logs for each day. Clicking the date at the top of the screen will give you the available logs that you can view. By selecting the day, you can see all of your duty statuses for that day. Here you can also click on the duty status to edit any of the duty statuses other than drive time. In order to edit, tap on the duty status you would like to edit. Click the edit button in the upper right. Now you can adjust the times for which you want to edit. First select the duty status you would like to change to. Then select the times for which you may need to change. When day logs are edited, it is required to provide a location as well as an annotation to explain the reason for the edits made to the log. After entering the annotation, click the Save button and the log will be saved. Click the Back button in the upper left to return to the previous screen. Click on the More tab to view the DOT 8-day inspection report. Here you can see all of your logs for the last 8 days, as well as export them via a PDF or a printed copy via a wireless printer, or send a data file to the DOT data transfer server. By clicking More and under Adapters, you can see which adapters are programmed to your device. You can also select Default Adapter and make an adapter auto-connect when in range. 
In the Loads tab, you will be able to create loads as well as accept loads assigned to you by your dispatcher. In order to start a load, you must fill out all of the required information. Once all the required information is entered, you can click Start Load. After starting a load, you can click to do your Driver Vehicle Inspection Report. If no defects are found, click Safe to Operate. To add defects, click the green plus sign by Add Defects and begin typing the name of the defect. As you are typing, similar items will self-populate from the menu provided inside the app. Here we have added bud flaps. As we certify a report, it will ask us to provide comments around the defects that we have listed. Enter the defects, certify your report, and then select whether it is safe to operate. New DVIRs can always be added daily by going back to the load screen as long as you are on a current load. Now, when clicking on the map screen and clicking on the search menu, my current load will show up as the first search result. In order to complete the navigation requirements, you must enter a height, length, weight, width, and whether or not you are hauling hazardous materials. Once this data is entered, you can click on View Route and see your routing for your load. These are the basic features and functions of the ZConnect app. Please stay tuned for future videos describing additional functionality. And thank you once again for choosing ZConnect the simple and affordable ELD compliance solution.